In the name of Allah, the Gracious, the Merciful. O Prophet! If any of you divorce women, divorce them during their period of purity, and calculate their term. And be pious before Allah, your Lord. And do not evict them from their homes, nor shall they leave, unless they have committed a proven adultery. These are the limits of Allah, whoever oversteps Allah's limits has wronged his own soul. You never know, Allah may afterwards bring about a new situation. Once they have reached their term, either attain them honorably, or separate from them honorably. And call to witness two just people from among you, and give upright testimony for Allah. By that is exhorted whoever believes in Allah and the last day. And whoever fears Allah, he will make a way out for him. And will provide for him from where he never expected. Whoever relies on Allah, he will suffice him. Allah will accomplish his purpose. Allah has set a measure to all things. As for those of your women who have reached menopause, if you have any doubts, their term shall be three months, and also for those who have not menstruated. As for those who are pregnant, their term shall be until they have delivered. Whoever fears Allah, he will make things easy for him. This is the ordinance of Allah, which he sent down to you. Whoever fears Allah, he will remit his sins, and will amplify his reward. Allow them to reside where you reside, according to your means, and do not harass them in order to make things difficult for them. If they are pregnant, spend on them until they give birth. And if they nurse your infant, give them their payment. And conduct your relation in amity. But if you disagree, then let another woman nurse him. The wealthy shall spend according to his means, and he whose resources are restricted shall spend according to what Allah has given him. Allah never burdens a soul beyond what he has given it. Allah will bring ease after hardship. How many a town defied the command of its Lord and his messengers? So we held it strictly accountable, and we punished it with a dreadful punishment. It tasted the result of its decisions and the outcome of its decisions was perdition. Allah has prepared for them a severe attribution. So beware of Allah, O you who possess intellect and have faith. Allah has sent down to you a reminder. A messenger who recites to you Allah's verses, clear and distinct, that he may bring those who believe and work righteousness from darkness into light. Whoever believes in Allah and acts with integrity, he will admit him into gardens beneath which rivers flow, therein to abide forever. Allah has given him an excellent provision. Allah is he who created seven heavens, and their like of earth. The command descends through them, so that you may know that Allah is capable of everything, and that Allah encompasses everything in knowledge.